All right. Uh, thought I'd talk about my uh, season three plans for this upcoming season. And uh, first off, I'm going to be running the NASCAR iRacing series. Um, uh, we have 16 races to go, and there's no break in between. And uh, right now, I'm sitting second in my division, which is Division Four. And um, things are going pretty good in this series. I really like the longer races, and uh, I'm having a lot of fun. And so I'm going to be continuing on that front. Uh, as you can see, that's my car right there in the thing. And um, I'm also planning to be running some uh, Class A fixed races this season. It kind of depends on uh, how much time I got and uh, and how I feel with the track and the car and and that type of stuff. So if I'm comfortable, I'm going to be running some uh, Class A fixed series. And then there's probably going to be some other uh, oval races I'll be doing. I'll probably run some Class B fixed a little bit since uh, David Gator is now setting up the, the cars. Um, another thing, I'm going to be running the late model series. That's the full season there. Um, I did have a lot of fun this season in the late model, except for maybe a couple races uh, where some people kind of got to me a little bit. But uh, one thing I'm doing in this series, I'm learning setups. And uh, that's something that uh, I still need to learn at. Right now, I kind of look on the forums and look on a couple websites and try to grab some setups and find out what's best for me and then do a little tinkering here and there. So uh, I'm knowing enough to like, you know, raise and lower the track bar and maybe some springs and, you know, try out staggers and that type of stuff. But I really don't know too much, so I'm just kind of learning setups and that. So this is gonna also going to be another one of my uh, series I'm going to do. And then on the road side, um, I'm going to be running the GT3 Challenge again this year. Um, right now you see the, the rough Porsche, and uh, that will be one of the cars that I run. kind of depends on, the, on how I feel about that. Right now I'm kind of comfortable in the, in the Porsche. I'm going to be running that in the Spot 2.4 here uh, coming up. And uh, so I'm, I'm kind of enjoying that car at this uh, moment. And I uh, really enjoy the tracks. It's a real popular series. It does get wild, but, uh, you know, that's okay. It's just uh, the way it is in this series, but it's uh, still a lot of fun, and there's a lot of participation, so you can always find a race. Um, another car I'll be running is the McLaren in the GT3 Challenge. Again, it kind of depends on how I feel on the track and how the car feels. Um, right now I'm, I feel better in the Porsche than I am in the McLaren, but McLaren is one of my favorite cars to drive. So I really enjoy driving this car, and now I love the backfire coming out of the back end there. Um, that's one of my, uh, one of my favorite things. But, uh, I'll be running that. A new series and a new car I'm going to be running is the World Sports Car Series. Um, I'm going to be running the Ford GT car in this thing. It's, a uh, brand new car for me and I'm just learning how to drive it and uh, but it's the car I want to drive in this series and I've, I figured it'd be kind of fun it will be the slowest car there is the Daytona prototype and the HPD also running this series so they're going to be lapping us like crazy but uh, I want to run this car and uh, another reason why I want to continue to run this car is because it's also going to be included in the GT3 uh, series when uh, when they have that car finished and so this was uh, buy one buy once and get two cars so I had to take advantage of that and that's uh, the Ford GT so I'm going to be running this series they're 45 minute races and a few with uh, 70 minute races so I thought it would be alright uh, here's the what my I'm going to get serious about road uh, racing on is the Star Mazda I uh, heard a lot of good things about this car it sounded like a lot of fun and so I purchased the car and uh, did some testing on it just with the default setups and uh, that's all I'm going to probably be running for a while is the default setups. Um, and But it was, it, was, uh, it was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed this car and I thought this, this is going to be a fun series to run in. Um, of course not expecting to do well. I'm going to be brand new. Put the rookie stripes on me now. But I thought it should be fun. So anyway, that's what I'm going to be doing for the Oval and Road for Season 3. So thank you for uh, uh, continuing watching. Bye-bye.